Royals Coronation Rolls, Louis Carriage Ride, Kate's Message and Meghan Snub. Planning for King Charles' coronation is in full swing, and reports have suggested which royals will have prominent roles in the ceremony and processions such as Queen Camilla and possibly Prince George, and which will not. The coronation of King Charles will be the first time in 70 years that the UK or even the world has seen such a historic spectacle. He will be officially crowned at Westminster Abbey on May 6 a little over six weeks' time, meaning final preparations and plans for the big day will currently be in the process of being finalised. But it won't just be the monarch who will have a role to play in the coronation. Other members of the royal family will also have prominent parts to play in the ceremony and the procession afterwards. And although Buckingham Palace is yet to confirm the exact roles for each member of the firm, there have been numerous reports on what we can expect to see, and here we take a look at them. Not only will King Charles be crowned at the coronation, so too will his wife Queen Camilla. She will go through the same service as her husband and will eventually be crowned using Queen Mary's crown during the historic event on May 6. It is the first time in recent history that an already existing crown will be used during the coronation of a queen consort instead of a new one being made. The palace says the decision to do this was made in the interests of sustainability and efficiency. However, the palace says that some minor changes and additions will be made to it by the crown jeweler in keeping with the long-standing tradition that the insertion of jewels is unique to the occasion, and reflects the consort's individual style. The changes will see the crown reset with the Cullinan three IV and V diamonds, which were part of Queen Elizabeth's personal jewellery collection for many years and often worn by her as brooches. Meanwhile, it has been reported that rarely seen grandkids are set to star in the coronation. The Sunday Times reported that Camilla has asked her grandchildren to hold a canopy over her as she is anointed with holy oil during a part of the ceremony. Her son Tom Parker Bowles has two children Lola, 15, and Freddie, 13, and her daughter Laura Lopes has Eliza, 15, and twins Louis and Gus, 13. As heir to the throne and the next king, Charles' eldest son Prince William is expected to play a major role in the coronation. And it has been reported he may be the only one to carry out an important tradition usually reserved for royal dukes. According to the Sunday Times, he pay homage to his father the king during the ceremony, which will see him kneel and pledge allegiance to Charles as well as touching the crown and kissing the monarch's right cheek. It is also believed he will take part in the huge procession after the service from Westminster Abbey back to Buckingham Palace before taking part in a balcony appearance. According to coronation rehearsal documents seen by the Times, Kate will be among the working royals taking part in the carriage procession and balcony appearance with her husband. Dr. Tessa Dunlop previously told The Mirror, history suggests working royals will stand out. In 1953, the Queen's sister Princess Margaret had her own coronation gown designed by Norman Hartnell, embroidered with roses and daisies and offset with a stunning Cartier tiara. She travelled to the Abbey with the Queen Mother and they sat in a box overlooking proceedings with a four-year-old Prince Charles squashed between them. A similar scenario for the Princess of Wales and her three children is likely. William and his offspring are next in line to the throne and coronations deliberately emphasize the order of precedence and succession. Like it or not this state occasion is all about royal hierarchy. Visual messaging through both costume and carriage will remind us who the future king and queen are. Whether the Sussexes like it or not. One of the youngest set to take part in the coronation is another future king, Prince George. It is believed he will be among the royals taking part in a procession from the abbey, joining his parents in a carriage behind the king and queen, who will be in the gold state coach. But given the fact he is second in line to the throne, it has been reported he might get a role during the ceremony itself. But knowing how much scrutiny this could put the nine-year-old under, it is believed that William and Kate would prefer Georges' role will be small.
Sunday Times Royal Editor Roya Nikar previously told True Royalty TV's The Royal Beat. They are very keen. But if George does have an official role, it will be quite low-key. They are very conscious that he will return to school on the Tuesday, after the coronation, and they do not want him to be overwhelmed by the attention. But he may play a smaller official role. Princess Charlotte and Prince Louis. Along with their older brother George, Princess Charlotte, who will be eight at the time of the coronation, and Prince Louis, who will have turned five, are expected in the procession. They too will join the royals as they leave the abbey and head back to Buckingham Palace in a huge procession. Charlotte attended the late Queen's funeral last September with George, but Louis did not as he was deemed too young. It is still not clear if Harry and Meghan will choose to come to the UK for the coronation or decide to stay at home. However, a spokesperson for the couple confirmed they had been in contact with the palace over the coronation and would make a decision in due course. But according to the Times, if they do decide to head to London for the historic event, as working royals, they will find themselves without official roles in the procession.